Getty Image sub BC photo archives in light of the news that suspicious packages have been sent. To key political figures, the views Meghan McCain took some time to reflect. On Thursday's episode, Whoopi Goldberg opened up a discussion about the intercepted packages intended for former Vice President Joe Biden and actor Robert De Niro. She also touched upon President Trump's claim that the media is to blame for the anger in society. Advertisement, continue reading below. After Sunny Hostin and Whoopi weighed in, Megan jumped in to share her thoughts and brought up a comment she had previously made about former Secretary of State Hillary Clinton, who was also reportedly sent a pipe bomb on Wednesday. I really try every day. I really try to come into work thinking about what rhetoric I'm going to put out in the world and what my father would have done if he was still here. Last year on this show I said, I hate Hillary Clinton, and I called her crooked Hillary, and it is one of the things I regret doing. This is not saying I agree with her. I have many vast differences of opinion on philosophy and ideology, and I didn't think she was a great candidate. But hate is not a word that should be coming out of my mouth on television about someone of a different political persuasion. Megan continued to say that she needs to hold herself to the same standard that she wants to hold President Trump to, even though she gave up on his ability to hold this standard a long time ago. She also said she implores everyone else in media to own up to their mistakes. I need to hold myself to the same standard that I would like to hold the president, Meghan McCain shares how she regrets a comment made on it. The view she says contributed to polarization. I can't give in to hate. It's too great a burden to bear. I have to stick with love. Pick.twitter.com slash eyes one my ask. The view at the view. October 26, 2018. She went on. I'm not going to tell you I'm always going to succeed, but I do regret doing that. Because I thought, what have I done to contribute to the polarization in this country? And that is one thing that I can own that I did. Advertisement, continue. Reading below Megan's powerful speech resonated with Sunny, who proceeded to tell her that it takes a big person, and one, of great character, to say what she did. Besides, Sunny, people online on both sides of the aisle seemed moved by Megan's words. Good. For you, Megan. Thank you for trying to end the divisiveness in this country. Your Dad would be proud, Chris Haber Ritaka, at Chris Ritaka, October 26, 2018, from across the aisle. I respect you so much, Rick Ross, at Top Guns 01, October 26, 2018. What a real woman does. She may not agree with HRC, but the McCain morals show through. It takes a big person, a good person, to admit their mistakes, particularly on a show air. Millions watch. We are all Americans' first people. Lifelong Democrat, but love me some Megan. Alyssa Webb, at Webb Alyssa, October 26, 2018 Actress Lena Dunham also had kind words to say about Megan. A real woman knows how to say, sorry, I was wrong, you're a true crown, Lena Dunham, at Lena Dunham, October 26, 2018 Megan's comments come after she said she has been doing lots of soul-searching after the death of her father, Senator John McCain, in August 2018.